Hello, my name is Anushka Shavasab and I'm a rising junior in the World Bachelor in Business program, which is a partnership between USC, HKUST, and Bocconi University. Since I filmed my Day in the Life video with Crimson, I finished my freshman year at USC where I found some of my best friends and I also planned and organized uh, the largest hackathon USC's ever had called Hack SC. Then I went to Peru and consulted for a social enterprise after which I came back and completed my summer with a summer internship in a company in the Bay Area. Then I went to Hong Kong for my second year of college and I spent the first three months traveling and exploring the city uh, after which I had to return back to United States because of the protest situation there. So a lot of college students actually got to experience online education this year because of the COVID-19 situation. However, I got to experience online system of education because of the protests in Hong Kong. So last November, the protest situation in Hong Kong really escalated and we were evacuated. So I had to complete my first semester uh, online. And then when it came to February of this year, when I had to go back to Hong Kong, uh, the COVID-19 situation in that region of the world had actually really uh, just started to um, rise and we decided that it might not be a good idea to go back to Hong Kong uh, in the beginning of the semester so we would just you know start with an online system but when things would get better we were going to go back however um, you know things only got worse so I actually ended up um, spending the entire semester from home in the Bay Area uh, taking classes at weird hours so you know my classes would all be Hong Kong time uh, the earliest class I would have would be from 6 p.m. and most of my classes would actually end up going until 2 or 3 in the morning. I even had to take some of my finals at absurd hours like 4 or 5 uh, a.m. so I had a very interesting experience with online education. So this upcoming year, I was actually supposed to be going to Milan, Italy for my third year of college. However, due to various reasons, I have decided to take a gap year. And I hope to spend the upcoming year uh, developing some personal and professional skills. So I'm really looking forward to this. And in this upcoming year, my only goal is to try out as many different things as possible and to really, you know, enrich myself in everything. So if I were to give my old self some piece of advice, I would truly say that, you know, value what you have and when you have it. Time truly flies when you're having fun and, uh, you know, there are a lot of moments when you have fun and there are a lot of moments when you have to study hard, but, you know, just really value what you have. So if you're going to college this upcoming fall, I would really recommend you keep an open mind and look for opportunities uh, despite various challenges. And you know, I always truly believe that there's always something to do and something that you know you can make good use of your time with. So in terms of whether the World Bachelor in Business program has lived up to its expectations, definitely. But was it exactly how I expected things to be? Not really. I mean, I wasn't expecting much and you know, when I actually ended up going to Hong Kong my second year, uh, it's it was nothing from what I had imagined. And, you know, the protest situation and the riots that took place, I think it was a really interesting time to be there. And I definitely think I learned a lot and grew a lot from the entire experience. And, you know, my favorite part about this program has definitely been living with my cohort uh, and living in the same apartment with uh, a lot of my friends. So just being able to explore a new city and living in a country so far away from home um, has definitely taught me a lot. Extracurriculars have largely varied due to the nature of the program and all the travel associated with it. So I've changed a lot of clubs, however, the one club that I'm still involved with is 180 Degrees Consulting. Uh, and this semester, because I was taking online classes from home, I decided to pursue new skills and try out new activities. So I enrolled myself in an improv class and I started learning Bollywood dancing, how to play a bamboo flute, uh, and just a lot of fun activities. And I have also just begun uh, volunteering for uh, an organization that helps teach kids in rural parts of India how to speak in English and other uh, subjects as well. Thank you.